What's up my beautiful friends? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are doing well. I'm doing pretty good. Today we are doing a what's in my gym bag video and this is pretty much like my gym bag, my work bag because I do work at a gym and this is also going to include a lot of my gym essentials, stuff that I have to have at the gym with me no matter what. Oh and p.s. if you hear random noises in the background it's because there's a huge storm about to happen outside, a huge thunderstorm and so there's really big gusts of wind so if you hear that We'll just ignore it and hopefully there's no loud cracks or anything to scare us or me, but we'll see. And so yeah, let's just get on with the video. All right, so this is my gym bag and it's a book bag. It's not like the typical gym bag, but it's a book bag and it's an affinity book bag. So if you guys don't know what that is, it's like a typical cheerleader book bag. So it's very sparkly as you guys can see. On the outside of this bag, I have a couple bows here. I have a big one and two small ones. I have two pins here and they're from competitions. So one's the world's pin and then the cheer fest pin. And then on the other side, I have a plain black baseball cap. This is the baseball cap I wear all the time. And I just like to bring it and attach it to my bag because sometimes I go for walks with my mom and sometimes I wanna wear a hat and that's just it. It's there in case I need it. So we're gonna start with the first pocket and it's the big pocket on the back of the bag and it just has some work stuff in here. So it has my laptop, which is just, you know, typical. I work on some stuff here. Next, I have my notebook and this is just a notebook that I use to write all my videos and do all the planning and all that jazz inside of here and also in this bag I have a book and this is May Cause Miracles by Gabrielle Bernstein and this is just a book that is like a 40 day kind of transformation book and I'm not doing it day by day I've gone through this book before but it's just sometimes when I'm having a rough day this is a good one to have so I just like to read it every once in a while and remind myself to be a better person and just really connect with my spirituality. So in the top of this bag it's actually quite interesting it's not just like a loose kind of normal book bag it has a pocket for your laptop and a strap so it can secure your laptop in there. It has a lot of padding and so it's safe for your laptop to go in there. My cat was literally just playing with her tail there it was actually really funny. Moving on to the next Next pocket we got a water bottle and now this is just obviously important to have it's a huge gym essential to have and this is just my Gatorade bottle it's just a typical water bottle I like this kind of water bottle the ones that just squirt in your mouth you don't have to take off a lid or anything you just squirt in your mouth it's perfect I love it so it's pretty essential to have because during a workout you usually die of thirst so this is just great to have next in my gym bag I actually have kind of a lot of clothes so bear with me. During the cheer season especially, I always have a pair of extra shorts just in case it's hot and I don't want to work out in leggings. So I have some Victoria's Secret spandexy shorts here and these are ones that I just have in my bag in case I ever need them. Next I have a tank top. So this is always in my gym bag because I have been going to physiotherapy because I have a ruined arm, I guess you can say. I have a really big dysfunctional arm over here. I have elbow issues and shoulder issues and so when I go to physiotherapy I need to wear a tank top and very often I forget to wear a tank top and I wear a t-shirt so I need to you know. So this is just always in my gym bag. Next is just a plain black sweater and honestly it's just there when I get cold or when I just want to put a sweater on. It's nothing really special. Moving on to some gym essentials. I have this little pouch here and inside this pouch are a lot of rubber bands. Oh my god. So there's just a bunch of different resistant rubber bands in here and they're different resistance and I like to use them while working out, especially on leg day. They're very helpful. And so I just bring them with me because the gyms don't always have these rubber bands. I like to work with them quite often, so I keep them with me. I put them back in now. Another gym essential is a skipping rope. So my I just bring my skipping rope with me. I'm actually trying to practice to do a double skip. Like, you know when you double the skip rope? within one jump. I'm trying to learn how to do that, but I really suck at it. So if you guys have any tips, let me know. I haven't really conquered it yet. And another gym equipment essential, I guess you can say. This is important to me because of my injury. This is just a one pound weight, and I know it's just a one pound weight is weird, but I can't lift very much with my arm right now. I can only do so much with different movements. I can lift some things here, like that's not so bad. Doing some different exercises, it is hard on my elbow. I do have a lot of problems, so one pound it's good enough for me and so I bring this little guy everywhere with me because surprisingly some gyms do not have a one pound weight so I have to bring my little guy with me and I've just been working with this little guy and that's why he's in my book bag so I have an extra pound in my book bag 
because of this guy. Another gym essential that I have to have in my bag is a pair of socks. An extra pair of socks are so important because sometimes when you get to the gym and you don't wear like your running shoes there and you get there and you're not wearing socks, it sucks if you forget your socks at home. So it's always good to have a second pair of socks. Plus sometimes when you're really sweating at the gym, I, this is gonna be like probably TMI or gross for some people, but when you're really sweating at the gym and your feet are sweaty, you might wanna change your socks, so. I just like to bring an extra pair, you never know. Also, I like to bring some food, especially in my work shift, I gotta bring some snacks. Oh my God, the cats are chasing each other out here. I can't, I can't handle it. Anyway, so some snacks, I just have some trail mix here and I just bring it with me so I can have a snack while I'm working. And it's also good to eat after your workout because you know, you don't wanna lose your workout. If you don't eat within a half an hour after your workout, apparently you lose half your workout, so. I like to bring snacks with me. For some more gym essentials I have is a cord to charge my phone, a plug into the wall, and then a portable charger. And so I just like to bring this with me in case my phone dies. You know, you know the deal, guys. Next, my number one gym essential is this. And it is so important to me, and I know it sounds crazy, but it's very important to me and my skin. And so this is just a wipe that is like, it's, they call it a grease relief cleansing cloth and this is very important to me because it really helps my skin when i work out this especially helped me during cheer because after cheer when you're sweating and it's just disgusting i would have to drive home for an hour and a half hour and 15 minutes and so the sweat would stay on my face and my face would break out really really bad and so i have these guys so that when i do a workout or anything like that i would be able to sweat and then when i would get in the car i could just wipe off you know, all the sweat, clean my face, and take me over to the time till I got home, and then be able to wash my face. So these are really great to just, you know, clean the sweat off your face. It, it really helps. Another great gym essential that I have in here is a simple little hair elastic. And a hair elastic is very important, guys, especially for a girl with long hair, okay? Because if you go to the gym and you don't bring a hair elastic, it's like detrimental to your entire workout. I can't stand when my hair is down, it drives me nuts. And so this little elastic saves my life so many times. And so when you go to the gym and you forget it and you're like, oh my God, no. And then you're like, oh yeah, I brought an extra elastic. I'm good. So then you can work out comfortably and not like feel all sticky or anything, so. Yeah, my next big gym essential too is headphones. I mean, I love to work out with headphones. I can't stand working out without headphones. And these are actually really great. They're just good to have. These are the Apple headphones. You, you know what it's like to work out without headphones. Next, I also have some tampons. I don't really need to say more. It's just, you gotta have some in your bag. I also have some deodorant some mascara and some eyebrow gel. And so after a workout, I just like to put these on just to make my face look a little refreshed. And then I also have a little sweet treat. These are Chimes Ginger Chews and I love these, they're so good. And whenever I have a little hankering for a sweet treat, these are so great. They just pass me over on the time and they're all natural and vegan and you know, all that stuff. And this is, it tastes like a ginger, but it also has a mango flavor to it and it's just so good. All right guys, that is all that I have today. These are all my gym essentials. And if you guys are watching this, you are watching this on a Wednesday, and I don't usually upload on a Wednesday. If you guys know my schedule, it's usually Monday, Friday. But for the month of June, I am uploading Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and so it's three times a week, so that's awesome. So don't forget to tune in every Wednesday. If you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button down below or on my face. It should be popping up now. I want to thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys on Friday. Bye!